Ibex. In the Alps, there are wild animals that have characteristics like goats. These wild goats in the Alps have the ability to nimbly climb steep and rocky cliffs. These goats are known as alpine ibex and are known for their climbing abilities. The ibex is a species of wild mountain goat, which has curved horns. Male ibex have horns, the horns can grow as long as 70 to 140 centimeters. Whereas in female ibex, the horns are slightly shorter, thinner, and curved slightly backwards. These horns are used to defend themselves from predators. Ibex can grow to about 1.5 meters long, about 1 meter high, and weigh about 122 kilograms. Male ibex are usually larger and heavier than females and have a beard. Ibex have a short coat that varies in color from reddish brown in winter to tawny gray in summer. The male ibex has a beard on his chin. These animals are also very strong and agile which allows them to jump over rocky ledges. Ibex live in groups of 10 to 20 individuals. Schools of males and females will only join together during breeding season. Some of the animals that are predators for ibex are wolves, bears, foxes, and lynx. Meanwhile, Ibex chicks are also vulnerable to attacks by large predatory birds, such as eagles. Ibis Ibis is a member of the bird group Aves of the order Cycnae forms of the family Threskionithidae. Ibis birds generally forage in groups. Ibis has a large body size with a long hooked beak. The little Ibis bird's legs are long. Ibis birds like waters such as rivers, swamps, lake edges, rice fields and swamp forests or stagnant meadows. That's where the ibis bird looks for food. With its long beak, it probes the mud for food. The main food of this bird is aquatic animals from the crustacean subphylum crustaceans, namely shrimp, crayfish, lobsters, crabs, barnacles. The ibis bird's beak is wide, at the end of the beak like a spoon or long pointed depending on the species. Judging from the shape of the beak, there are several types of ibis, namely the ibis with a beak like a spoon spatula and the ibis with a pointed beak. Most ibis species nest in trees. Iguanas Iguana is a large lizard, which reaches 1.5 meters from head to tail and weighs up to 8 kilograms. Iguanas are often the choice to be pets, because they are easy to get. There are two types of this animal, namely the green iguana and the lesser Antilles iguana. The distinctive feature of iguanas is that they have crests under their jaws, as well as rows of scales forming large spines on their upper body, which line from the neck to the base of the tail. In addition, iguanas also have eye-like organs on the top of their heads. The organ serves to analyze the light around it. Iguana body color varies, ranging from bright green, green-brown, moss green, yellowish green or grayish, or caramel brown. The iguana's tail is the same color as the body and is decorated with black or dark stripes from base to tip. Iguanas are well adapted as tree lizards and herbivorous lizards. However, they still need animal nutrition, usually by eating small insects found in the plants they eat. Most iguanas are herbivores and eat only vegetation such as flower buds, fruits and young leaves. However, there are several iguana species that are omnivores. Omnivorous iguanas eat crickets, baby mice, and also plants. However, some of their favorite foods that they actively forage in the wild include 1. Flowers such as hibiscus, roses, and orchids 2. Leafy vines like princess vine and balloon vine 3. Flowering vines like bougainvillea 4. Tropical fruits such as melon, mango, and papaya 5. Umbrella plants 6. 
leaves of various fan palms 7, dark green and leafy vegetables 8, vegetables like pumpkin and tomatoes 9, various small fruit and other types of flowers. Impala Impala is a type of antelope in Africa, which is medium in size. The impala's habitat is savanna grasslands, or forests close to water sources. Impala is a fast runner, and is known for its ability to jump up to 3 meters. Impala body length, around 120 to 160 centimeters. Male height, around 75 to 92 centimeters and weight, around 53 to 76 kilogram. Female height, about 70 to 85 centimeters and weight, about 40 to 53 kilogram. The impala's color is a shiny reddish brown. The slender lyre-shaped horns of males are 45 to 92 centimeters, 18 to 36 in, long. Impala, active especially during the day, while at night the impala is used to rest and sleep. Impalas are gregarious and often live in colonies. Impala is very good at jumping, his jumps can reach a length of 3 meters, because of this jump the impala can easily avoid predators. These mammals use a combination of grazing and browsing leaves and shrubs. Basically, they eat the most mana at the time. When grazing, they prefer softer grass which has a higher nutritional value, rather than some of the tougher grasses that may be consumed by other animals. The herd will graze together, and individuals on the outskirts will remain more alert while feeding. This helps the whole flock avoid predators. The three-week annual custom occurs towards the end of the rainy season, usually in May. Male impala fight for dominance, for females. Impala pregnancy lasts six to seven months, after which a cub is born and is quickly hidden under cover. Impala pups are breastfed for four to six months. Young impala males are forced out of the all-female group to join other young males, while the female impala will remain. Indri Indri also called babakoto, is one of the largest living lemurs, with a head-to-body length of about 64 to 72 centimeters. The animal has a black and white pattern, has an upright posture when climbing or embracing. Indri live in small family groups, moving from place to place by climbing. The Indru is purely herbivorous, its main diet being leaves as well as seeds, fruits and flowers. Indri live in groups, very vocally communicating with other groups by singing, buzzing and other vocalizations. Indru has long arms and legs that help her swing from tree branches. In fact, its hind legs can jump as far as 10 meters from one tree branch to another. The female Indri is more powerful in the group than the male. Meanwhile, the females, especially the female leader of the group, control the upper tree branches. As soon as they reach adulthood, female Indri gets food priority. They have access to the highest tree branches with the highest quality leaves. The dominant female also leads the group when traveling. The Indri group can cover distances of up to 700 meters in a day. Iceland Gull The Iceland Gull is a medium-sized gull, with a relatively slimmer and shorter beak, and has wings that are long enough to exceed the tail. The adult Iceland Gull is pale grey on the back and wings, the beak is yellow, the head and neck are brownish-white. But as juveniles it is light brown to medium mottled with white, its back is pale grey with brownish speckled wings and a dark beak. Iceland seagull's feet are pink at all ages. The Iceland gull is a good flyer, and it beats its wings fairly quickly. How to find food for this bird by flying low over seawater and then swooping down to grab fish or other food without landing. These birds breed on coastal cliffs in the high Arctic and forage in open water among the ice flows. In winter they emerge along the coast and forage near shores, on beaches, and sometimes in lawns, agricultural fields, and garbage dumps. The Iceland gull consists of three subspecies which are most conspicuous by the color of the wingtips. The Icelandic form breeds in Greenland and winters mainly in the North Atlantic, including Iceland. It has very pale to completely white wingtips. The subspecies Cumlin is the form most often seen in winter on the east coast of North America. 
The wingtips vary from almost white to gray. Winter, Thayer, forms on the west coast of North America. It usually has slightly darker wings, dark gray to black wingtips, and thick streaks or streaks on the head and neck in winter. There is considerable overlap between each of these forms, and some individuals cannot be easily assigned to subspecies based on plumage.